Hey YouTube, welcome back to Fallout Plays. Today I want to take a quick minute to tell you about a weapon perk that is very deadly in the Crucible at the moment, and that perk is Final Round. For those of you who don't know, Final Round is a weapon perk that makes the final bullet in your gun's clip do an extra 33% damage. And while that might not sound very impressive, it allows for some weapons to be abused in PvP pretty hard, most notably high impact sniper rifles. As I'm sure you've noticed by now, there are basically two types of sniper rifles in Destiny. Type number one, low impact with high rate of fire, like Praetid's Revenge, Final Boss, and The Chosen, and type number two, high impact with low rate of fire, like Ephrodite's Spear, the Silvered Boudica, and the LDR 5001. Type number two is the one I want to talk to you about. Any sniper rifle with high impact that is lucky enough to have the final round perk has the unbelievably helpful ability to kill any normal health enemy with one body shot if you hit them with that final round. And believe me when I tell you, landing that shot anywhere on the body will get you the kill. Anywhere. As you can probably imagine, this is pretty handy and can make a big difference in a match of PvP. The only downside is that if you want to do this on the regular, you have to constantly drain your magazine in order to get to the final round in your clip, which means you're going to be burning a lot of special ammo over the course of the game. With the recent release of patch 1.1.2, this is now pretty difficult because Bungie has cut down on a number of things, including the number of special ammo crates on the map, the rate at which they refill, and the amount of ammo you get from each crate. Here's a list of the most common crucible maps and how many special ammo crates spawn on each map. Now think about it this way. If you're playing Clash on Anomaly, that means there are three special ammo crates and 12 total players on the map. Odds are you're going to have a difficult time controlling those special ammo crates throughout the game because with 12 players on the map, things are going to get pretty chaotic. On the other hand, if you're playing, oh, let's say, Double Skirmish on the Cauldron, there are three special ammo crates, but only four players on the map, meaning that you'll probably have a much easier time getting access to and controlling the special ammo crates. What I'm trying to tell you is that you're going to be able to utilize final round more often on game types where you can easily control the special ammo crates, and for the most part, that's going to be skirmish, double skirmish, and salvage. I'm not saying it's impossible to use it in big game types like clash and control, but unless you have great teamwork and make every effort as a team to control and share the special ammo, you're going to have a harder time getting enough ammo to use final round on a regular basis. By the way, if you're really lucky and get a high impact sniper with both final round and armor piercing rounds, you can do things like this. Yep. All in all, final round is a great weapon perk for PvP so make sure to keep your eyes peeled for it the next time you get your hands on a new legendary or rare sniper with good impact. Alright guys, you know the drill. If you like this video, please hit like, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I am always working on new content. I hope you learned something, and I'll see you next time.